Hi, I'm here to talk to you about breath techniques and the importance of the breath during your meditation and your mindfulness practice. So when we take time to pause throughout the day and ground ourselves, which basically means being still, and if you can, feet firmly planted to the ground, finding a quiet, relaxing space to sit, we can engage with some breath techniques. So in everyday life, we can live on a mode of being in an autopilot state, which means we are rushing and racing, hurrying to the next task or location. But by consciously taking a mindful break, we can once again connect in with our breath and allow the breath to settle and come back to its calm, peaceful state, which is completely natural for us. But sometimes amidst the chaos and stress of daily living, we can forget how to calm ourselves. So the breath is one of the most effective tools we have for our mindfulness and our well-being on a daily basis. So I'm going to talk you through some examples of breathing techniques. So I'd like to begin with the deep abdominal breath technique. So a deep belly breath. So it's very simply done, it just requires some practice. If at any time it makes you feel lightheaded, please just return back to a normal breath. But for the purpose of this exercise now, just see can you try this one or two times, especially if you're a beginner at this, just building up your rounds very, very gradually. We only ever do what we are comfortable with, bearing in mind how we're feeling at this moment. So to begin this exercise, we need to place one hand on the abdomen, or two hands there, whatever you're more comfortable with. We need to do a posture check. So make sure you're sat back into your chair with your spine straight and your shoulders, just bring them up and down to relax them. And just softly close down the eyes. So just first of all, exhaling all the air out of an open mouth, blowing it all away. And then on your next inhalation breath, you're going to breathe deeply into the belly. And you're going to push the belly against your two hands. So breathing in deeply, belly pushes out against the hands. And exhale, the belly pushes all the way back down towards the spine. If you can, keep your shoulders down and relaxed during this exercise. And try repeating this again. So if you feel more comfortable, close down the eyes, allowing all the air to exhale out of an open mouth. And then taking a deep breath into the belly. As you inhale, pushing belly against the hands. Hold. And as you exhale, allowing the breath to push the belly in towards the spine. Shoulders down and relax. Just notice how you feel after a couple of rounds of your deep belly breath. Just notice has it changed your breath in any way at all. So 
So when the breath is calm, the mind and the emotions also follow and in turn naturally calm. So basically it's impossible to feel upset with a calm breath. So even if you're feeling strong emotions, if you can take a breathing space, it will naturally soothe the nervous system and naturally calm the mind or any emotions you're experiencing at present. So remembering we can always return to this breath. And then when you feel you've worked deeply enough with this routine, you can allow the breath to settle back down to normal. Another technique I would like to explain to you is an instant relaxer which may sound a bit strange, but we're going to actually create tension in our body to relax our muscles. So if you can, you're going to stretch out your arms and legs right now. You're going to start to clench the hands, the arms, feet, toes, legs, tummy, thighs, just see if you can bring tension into the body. Breathing in deeply as you hold this tension and then let go as you release all the tension. You can also try this with the face so you can close down the eyes and you can scrunch and tighten the face in as tightly as possible now. You can poke out your tongue if nobody's watching and then release. And then you can give the body a lovely big stretch, stretching out arms, legs, and just feel the release in the muscles for this technique. This technique is often used as well in body scans. It could be called a progressive deep relaxation, which is a longer version of what I just explained to you there. Another technique we can engage with is just basically a mindful and focused breath. So again, just closing down the eyes just simply observing and noticing your natural gentle breath as you breathe in and out. So you're breathing in peace and calm and you're exhaling and releasing any stress, any tension that you're holding on to at this time. Release it away with the exhalation breath. So for this purpose, we're not trying to change the rhythm, the routine of the breath. We're just allowing the breath to breathe itself. And all we're paying attention to is simply our next breath. Just one breath at a time. A great technique to use if ever you're feeling anxious or overwhelmed, as it really helps to ground you and bring you back fully to the present moment. Just focusing on your next breath. Feeling the cool air enter and leave the nostrils. Engaging fully now with this sense of peace and calm. Inhaling peace and calm. 
release and let go of any remaining tension. Just checking in and asking yourself, how am I feeling now for taking this time out of the day to be conscious and mindful of my breath? The last technique I wish to share with you is called a safe space. So again, with your eyes closed down. I would like you to visualize now that you are in your most favorite place. Place that you feel safe and secure. You're free from all stress. Attention. So visualize your surroundings, painting a clear picture, noticing particular colors, engaging your senses. What do you see? What do you smell? Engaging the sense of touch and feel. Noticing where you are. Are you in a lovely woodland or maybe sitting peacefully on your favourite beach? Wherever you are, just pause in this place and again connect in with the breath. Just taking a mindful breathing space in your special place. Just staying here for a couple of minutes, making sure the shoulders are down, the body is relaxed. Just enjoying your special space. Knowing that you can return here at any time, you so choose again in the future. So to summarize our tutorial on breath techniques, it's a very simple practice that doesn't require much time. It's something you can easily factor in throughout the day. By pacing your day, allowing yourself time to simply sit quietly and connect with the breath. So I hope you enjoy continuing to practice and work with some of the techniques I have explained to you. Thank you.